What areas of your life are you paralyzed in? You might be that man. You might have a level of paralyzation. Jesus deals with the paralyzed man, saying to him, your sin is forgiven. Sin paralyzes. Sin somehow in any area of your life that you allow something to persist, it will and exists, it will create some level of disconnect in that area. It'll it'll create, in that area, there'll be a level of shock and there'll be a level of disconnect and paralyzation that'll happen. Jesus hones that in when he says to him, your sins are forgiven. He's simply saying that paralyzation and bringing, bringing attention that sin in nature paralyzes. 